the aircraft just landed. It's the most fantastic sight I have ever seen. I'll load it under my instruction. It's fantastic. It's the most thrilling moment in my life as an air charter broker. It is one of the more challenging tasks I ever had. Today, we will uplift the longest piece of cargo that has ever been uplifted in the world. There is a risk, a minimal risk, that something could happen to the blades. While taking off, there are some forces that will attack to the blades or also by landing. The reason for the windmill blades that are being flown to Denmark is because of speed. They are needed in the test facility in a very short while. We want to test them in our facilities in Lunaskov, Denmark. We will be doing um, lifetime tests and extreme tests. We have studied all possible things, but we still don't know if we will make this happen this afternoon. We really much hope so, but it's never been tried before. For a long time, technicians of LM have been in daily contact with technicians of Antonov Design Bureau in Kiev, exchanging 3D models of the blades and 3D models of the internal cargo bay of the aircraft, thereby simulating in 3D how to load the blades exactly. The main challenges tonight will be, first of all, to mount the blade frame into wheels. We have to bolt them. Uh, this is in order to easily bring the blades into the, into the aircraft. Then the aircraft will be kneeling down and we will pull the blades into the, into the Antonov. Please, the, the people, the agents and the LM guys should step out. If we will take the truck, I'll load it under my instruction. Okay? Let's see if, uh, if the blades will be, uh, the wheels will be strong enough to to carry the weight up to the aircraft. That is the next challenge. Uh, we need to lower the blade back down so it sits in the cradle and the strap there. Um, We've got some uh, some extra straps to tie around to try and strengthen it a little bit more. So you think we should use the, the, the crane? Yeah, uh, probably the easiest way we can use crane. Okay. Okay. Good. Then uh, let's start doing that. <laughs> it's very dangerous. What's happening right now? If the if the blade doesn't move with the with the cradle, then it's going to to sweep and then it will smash. So how about if we put the two cranes? to hold the blade in case something happens. That will make sense? Just in case. If you take a look at the blade, it is very bulky and huge, but at the same time, uh, there are some parts that are very fragile, like the tip that is so sharp. So we have to be very, very careful at loading the, the blades. Nice, just, just, yeah. just a little bit. Eighty centimeters of clearance. Eighty centimeters. That's what we've got. And now we can start loading the second blade. I'm uh, very happy that we made it. Everything looks good. 
perfect conditions. We made it. It's a success.